A phone that you can wear on your wrist. This is a Lenovo C Plus and it was introduced at Lenovo Tech World. Right now it's a concept device, so don't expect to buy it soon. The device features a 4.26 inch segmented screen and runs Android. The segmented screen is how the device can actually bend around your wrist. However, the C Plus wasn't the only flexible device Lenovo showed off. There's also the Folio tablet. It looks like a standard tablet, except you could fold it in half to use as a phone. Now those products don't have a release date, but Lenovo did announce a bunch of phones that will hit the market soon. Say hello to the Moto Z and the Moto Z Force. The Moto Z Force will feature the same shatterproof screen as the Droid Turbo 2. Both Moto Z products can accept modular add-ons that the company calls Moto Mods. The mods connect to the Z phones using a magnetic connector. Lenovo showed off an extended battery pack, a speaker, and even a projector that can show images up to 70 inches in size. Unlike the LG G5, you'll be able to attach the mods to the Moto Z without having to turn off the phone. Oh yeah, there are no headphone jacks on either device. You'll have to use Bluetooth or an adapter for headphones. Both Moto Z phones will hit the US in the summer. The Moto Z will be available globally in September. The Z Force does not have a scheduled global release date. Lenovo also introduced the Lenovo Fab 2 Pro. This is the first phone that features Google Tango, which in a nutshell, is a depth sensing 3D camera system. The Fab 2 Pro can scan a room and place virtual objects in real space. The phone itself features a massive 6.4 inch screen. There are also other models of the Fab 2 that don't feature Tango. The Fab 2 line of phones will be available in September. I'm Aya Zaktar, and you can keep up with the hottest tech news at cnet.com slash update.